And now, from Fox 55 News, this is your local sports. Hey, good evening, everyone. Well, shout out to Comets play-by-play -vo play voice Shane Alberani for the primary assist on this stat. Get this, coming into tonight, the Comets were 27-3 and this season in games where they've scored first. And tonight, they were scoring early and often. Comets hosting the Wichita Thunder at the Coliseum. No goals for either team in the first period, but the Kays exploded in the second. Brady Shaw gets Fort Wayne on the board just two minutes into the period. Wichita would answer just 40 seconds later, but it was all Comets after that. Drake Rimshaw doing it himself. Kays retake the lead and they're not giving it back. Still in the second period, Kays on the power play and it's Sean Sidlowski striking again on special teams. His 15th of the season, it's 3-1. Just over a minute after that, Comets add another. Mason Berg takes advantage of the empty net off the rebound. You can make it 4-1 in favor of the orange and black and they're still not done. This time it's Berg with the long look ahead to Brady Shaw. Brady buries it in the back of the net, his second of the night, fifth of the period for Fort Wayne. Comets Cruz, 7-2, to two, your final. Well, I think it was playing within our structure. You know, when, when we're playing well within our structure and we're disciplined, we can read off guys because we know where they're going. And I thought our discipline was pretty good with getting pucks in behind their defensemen, forcing some turnovers, and um, we were going to the net. And when we were doing that, we're also drawing penalties. We're making them hook in their hold, and we're taking advantage of the power play, and we've had success on the power play all year. So you play the right way within structure, and you play a disciplined hockey game, you're going to earn your chances. And when you shoot the puck and you go to the net, some are going to go in some nights, some aren't. And the last two nights, they've been going in for us. So. We want to see that keep going. The Kays will definitely need it to keep going on Friday. The Comets will be home to host the Walleye at 8.05.